What is up ladies and gentlemen, Neon Pow here, bring you another tutorial. Let's get started. Welcome ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can fix a Bluetooth problem. I don't know, it might be just me, but I'm pretty sure it might be a majority. And basically what the Bluetooth problem is, you basically do not have Bluetooth. But as you see now, I do have Bluetooth since I've already did the method and made sure it worked. After I did it, I got Bluetooth. So I'm going to show you how I did it. So first of all, you're going to want to download this file. It's it's no it's not a bad file. It's not a random file. It's straight from the Broadcam company. I believe that's the uh, people who create Bluetooth or the software that it utilizes. So you just go there. I'll leave a link in the description. Make it easy for you guys. And then you're going to want to download it. And then after you download it, just open it up. Let's see here, what any dot zip file opener, WinRAR, or anything, 7-zip, um, let's see if I can move it, well, oh, can move it, that's just great, thank you, alright, then move it, open up the file that's in there, and there should be a setup.exe, and what you're going to want to do is just drag down to your desktop, after that close that up, and basically with the setup you're just going to want to click it, hit yes, it's going to be preparing to install and then basically after this is done you're just going to hit next a few times and it'll end up installing I'm not going to do it because I believe in it might corrupt the Bluetooth I already have in there and I don't want to mess up the Bluetooth I have and basically try to figure something out for it so just hit next install it pretty simple it's self-explanatory and then after that you should be well ago you just gotta um for me at least I had to restart my computer it says like some Windows Windows update was installing or something like that after I did it so after that it seemed that after that my Bluetooth was there and to make sure it's there and to like basically check it out and turn it on you can go here actually let's see devices Bluetooth printers and mouse so and there it is Bluetooth is there before it was not there I don't know why it just was not so after that Bluetooth turn it on everything should work properly so hope you guys enjoyed this simple quick tutorial um, if you have more questions about this tutorial or you just want any questions in general about Windows 10 just leave them in the comments below and I'll try to get to them so guys hope you enjoyed the video until next time peace yeah.